Greetings YouTube, this is BJ Black and welcome to chapter 11 of Land of the Night and the Heroes of Seven Worlds. So we finally got out of the Demon Castle. How many chapters did we spend in there? Jeez. So Alice is telling us Dranor Castle was turned into the other world, late Demon Castle to a romancer. And that's where the deciding battle is going to be held. If you approach the Demon Castle, the battle operation will start. It doesn't need to be said, but make sure you're prepared when you go. So first, this is new. We can come in here and check out our friends and allies. Just because it needs to be done. Let's change Toss's appearance back to a regular human appearance. Because I like regular humans too. Alright, so now that we're here, let's save because this is the last chance you get to save in the chapter. <laughs> hmm. Alright. We're standing where we can see the demon castle. Do you want to start the operation? So we can sail back out. But that's not what we're here for. All right, it's time for the deciding battle. Come, let's begin the operation. Well, better put our all into this. Already our preparations are completely full, are fully complete. I'm nervous, but I'll do my best. Gazing at the demon castle. We all rouse our spirits. Here and now, the seven heroes step out in a, in tandem. But having these seven heroes lined up, it's impressive. Feels like no enemy could we could we need not be afraid of any enemy. It seems like they would be completely routed from pleasure, though. A hen jaws. That is the worst pun ever. But anyway, Luvisa saying, Ralz wouldn't ahe. And Rijeo also says, Loret, Lorat would also not ahe. Magatsu says she would like to see Byakunin's face when he eye has. Taza says they all look tasty. Alright girls, enough of this commentary. Uh. Well then, amongst the enemies, there are nightmares. There should be also a lot of nightmares. Since nothing but pleasure works upon nightmares, be sure not to forget. By the way, seven heroes, in your original worlds, how many of you actually used sex battle, fought in sex battles? Are you sure? Ross, Lorat, and Nobisa raised their hands. Three of you. And further, all of you are the wordless types. Is there some cause and effect going on here? Maybe. Anyway, you remaining four are powerless against nightmares. Just don't forget that. Ten bucks says that those, at least a couple of those, will be completely surrounded by nightmares within a few minutes. So, against nightmares. All we can do is support, huh? Kind of makes my, kind of makes my teeth itch. 
Probably one of those Japanese sayings. In this sort of thing, I'm outside of my specialty. In my world, as soon as it gets to that, I'm already out. Hmm. Well, as far as it goes, we'll do our best to cover for you. Against nightmares, call me. Okay, sure. So then, let's start the operation. Maul Gilgorn. You know what you need to do? I understand, but... Aren't you forgetting one thing? That demon castle is... Originally... My Maol Castle. In other words, you guys have asked me to destroy my castle with my own handles. With my own hands. Jeez, it's a cruel th It's a cruel thing I've been... It's a cruel task that I've been come that I've come to. There we go. Now you can just build a new one. Here, I'll pour my power into you. Louisa places her palm upon Gilgorn's back and pours in power that can work against nightmares. Well, this being the case... Hmm... There it is! With this... Bat Castle... Which is a mixed... Bat Castrum... Castle mixed with... Reality and Dreams... Can't even be... You night... <laughs> you nightmares! You remember my power. Descend. Omega. No. It's a uh, meteor eclipse. Wow. Ooh. That's amazing. Destructive power even greater than expectations. With this, the those inside won't be able to ignore it. With just this one attack released by Gilgorn, the demon castle shakes. There are towers that, towers that fall and walls that crumble. Here and there, white smoke billows out. <laughs> Here's another one. Destroy it to... to dust. Destroy it to dust. Meteo Eclipse! I think she's having fun. So, another meteorite goes down. Another direct hit. The damage spreads. And a wall on the right side collapses. Gilgorn. These meteors. How many more can you drop? Hmm. I could easily drop another 30. Don't underestimate my magic power. Still another 30. Well, that's impressive. Well, if we drop that many on the castle, they'd be reduced to... Well, an empty plane. But, on the enemy side, they're not going to take this laying down. Look, there are enemies from the castle. So, dancing on out from the demon castle, and heading our way, countless flying shadows. There are nightmares and also regular monsters. Coming to hinder our attacks. Here they come. Fight back. 
Right, leave it to me. Don't let anyone get close to Gilgorn. Uh, I'm... I'll do my best too. Oops. I had to change this up a little bit. Because that other attack doesn't hit all the enemies. Still on Paradox difficulty, in case anyone cares. They're still coming. Don't let your guards down. Gilgorn, keep going like that. Leave it to me. Major Eclipse. So, another great meteor drop. The walls still... Still more walls crumble. And towers topple. And at the same time, the number of enemies headed our way increases. This too, these guys too, we also have to somehow fight off with our general forces. Jeez, there's just so many of them. Yeah, a fair number. There's hardly any time to catch your breath. Uh. You! You! Get lost! Huh? What's happened? <laughs> touchy, touchy, touchy! Stop! Stop it! Boy, you're so sensitive. Hee hee hee. Don't touch me, you imps! The imps are... on the winning side, I guess. And Gilgorn is close to collapse. This could be bad. How could a Mao be overwhelmed by mere imps? That's a good question. We've got to save her quickly. Is that quick enough? Huh. Huh. That was close. We defeat the imps. And... As she struggles to catch her breath, Gilgorn manages to right herself. For having done such things to me, you'll regret it. I'm still going. Meteor Eclipse. <laughs> so, she keeps with these bombing runs. And in proportion to the damage we deal to the castle, the flying enemies continue, the number of the flying enemies continues to increase. We're already using all of our forces to deal with the ones we have. We're near our limit. If more of them keep coming, we won't be able to protect Gilgorn. <laughs> the number of enemies is still increasing. If this continues like this, our defensive line won't hold. There's just so many. Even I'll be defeated. Hmm. Yeah, we'll leave everything to Minia. How about that? This is... Well, as expected, this is pretty tough. Such a number of enemies, we can't even kick them all back. Any more in the battle line really won't hold. Hey, this might be a little unreasonable here. <laughs> Is it okay if I play dead yet? Don't give up. Fight fiercely. I won't pull back even one foot, even one step. 
Meteor Eclipse. So under these many direct attacks upon the castle, the damage is great. Probably even on the interior, there's a great deal of damage. Yeah, I'll bet. But on the other hand, several of the enemies have broken through the defensive line. This is bad. Hey, over there, several have gotten through. I, I understand that, but we have our hands full too. in our attempt to fight off the ones we can see. Although we're... Okay, they've managed to slip through our counter efforts and they're approaching Gilgorn. This is no good. We won't make it in time. <laughs> Stay back! And th then as they dance towards Gilgorn. Kya. A barrier? Just who? Well, how many people have been silent this whole time? Ooh, yo, 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 yo. Did you think that I would not have foreseen this? Daimyomi. <laughs> To think you would have prepared a barrier ahead of time. That's amazing. You really got it in you. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Praise me. Praise me. Praise me even more. So just before Gilgorn, this barrier is constructed. And it's looked like it's defending her. To think that she'd be able to pull this out. But with this number, it's even more than I presumed. Even my barrier can only buy us some time here. I understand. Here goes. Come on, keep fighting seriously here. Don't pull back. Yeah, we won't let them pass. <laughs> they just keep coming. This is bad. My barrier is... Of course. The barrier is broken and the nightmares advance on Gilgorn. <laughs> I can still keep going. Made here eclipse. Oh man, it's lo looking good over there. Already, the castle is about to collapse. The white smoke that billows out here and there makes it hard to see the actual shape of the structure. But Gilgorn has been completely surrounded by nightmares. As expected, she won't hold any longer. Not yet. I will not bend. Meteor Eclipse. Even with a wall of nightmares around her, Gilgorn continues. Hey! You... If you don't want to die, keep your distance. With this, uh... With this, I'll obliterate you. Yeah! In her two hands, a great deal of magic power is concentrated.
Race them away. World Breaker! I think she's actually still attacking the castle. Instead of the nightmare surrounding her. But that's cool. Truly, this is a attack with all of her power. A thunderous collapsing sound causes the earth to shake. Alrighty, the demon castle is half collapsed. As far as a defensive position, this place is toast. And the one who accomplished that, Gilgorn, is... Uh-huh. Damn it, stop it, you! Ah, eh! Excuse me. Her small body is piled up with nightmares. She simply buried in them. Gilgord. We got to save her. Oh look, Minnie gets a level up. That means... That means that the level cap has been increased. Yeah, maybe not the most important thing to consider. So, we fought off the... Nightmares that were surrounding Gilgorn, and she's there trying to breathe. Well, she's been overwhelmed. She's hanging by a thread here. It looks like for a while she won't even be able to stand. Gilgorn. We will not forget your sacrifice. The demon castle is collapsed. And the people inside won't be able to pull out of the... The greater majority of those inside won't be unharmed. Thanks to Gilgorn's efforts. We've dealt a great blow to the enemy's forces. So then, we storm the castle. Is everybody prepared? We exchange glasses, and they all nod as one. You can see, their strong wills and strong resolve. We're finally here. The final stage. Come, let's go. That is how we, the seven heroes and our companions, rode into the demon castle. And what was waiting for us there was the final battle with the Alliance and the Lord of Dreams. Still missing in action herself. Well, as a result of this fierce battle, perhaps we'll be able to grasp victory. But perhaps this world will fall into the dream. At that same time, a small village in the southwest of Grand Noah. This time, it's a small village, isn't it? But we get naturally grown humans here, unlike in the capitals. Yeah, remember, to sustainably produce your food. Villager, what's this? Old guy, no way that could be there's been the rumor 
about the assaults on, t on villages. With this scale, dropping them all will be... won't take but an hour. So, with what, ki with what boy should I start? I'll start with this guy here. Dinner time. Except not. What? What is this? All the heroes should be attacking the demon castle right now. I'm no hero. I'm an angel. You suck you by. I'll crush you all together. Hey, just wait a minute here. Aren't angels supposed to be more kind? We are kind. To God's people. What? But sinners are executed. Hmm. So those are this world's supposed angels. More than those I've heard of in Legends, they look kind of boring. Well, wait a moment, Miska. I'll save you. Oh no. I'm going to keep you from moving here. Oh. There was one more. To think that you could prevent me from sensing your presence, if only for a moment. <laughs> I'm going to start with crushing you. How violent. I don't like that kind of thing. Execute, execute, execute. Classic gnosis. Hey, are you often told that your face is scary? Jeez, take this serious, Yuska. Under orders from our Lady Ilias, I'm going to crush the other worlders who threaten the who threaten the people of this world with my spear. <laughs> this has gotten rather interesting. Fighting with an angel. Unexpectedly, I'm getting excited. Well, I wasn't expecting this. But this is good. So, disorder in a small village caused by the entry of, well, both sides probably. Yeah. The assault by both the succubi and the seraphim. A battle that's going to shake the entire village has now been entered. So, that was chapter 11. Odd for it to end with the angels instead of with us, but thanks for watching, and I will see you next time.